What's up? How are y'all doing today? It's your boy Team Nat here, and today we're gonna to be talking about L5 HTP. So before you take anything like this, like L5 HTP, make sure you consult your doctor, your physician, your pharmacist, make sure it doesn't interact with any medicines you're currently taking or any conditions you currently may have. Uh, that's just my general warning with everything that you might take or see at the store. I actually heard of this because someone was looking for it for weight loss. Now, some of you are gonna ask, what is L5-HTP? Well, I'm glad you asked. L5-HTP is an amino acid. This is 100 milligram capsules. You can find these in 100 milligrams and 50 milligrams. L5-HTP is a byproduct of the amino acid L-tryptophan. When your body takes that in, it makes L5-HTP, and that helps with the biosynthesis of serotonin. I'm sure you guys have heard of serotonin before. It's very important in quite a lot of things that go on inside your brain. How do you get L-tryptophan? Again, L-tryptophan is an essential amino acid, which means that yes, it's naturally occurring in bodies, but you can only get it by eating things or taking a supplement of some sort. So like turkey, you know, how they say, oh, it's that tryptophan, it makes you sleep. It's because the tryptophan becomes this, and that creates serotonin, which is converted to melatonin, and that makes you fall asleep. So that's the thing that serotonin helps with restfulness, sleep. Now this is from Griffonia sim, shoot, how do you say that word? Simplicifolia. That is a plant in Africa that they get the extract from the seeds of that plant and that's where they get the L5-HTP from. If I were you and you haven't taken this stuff before, I would start at a lower dose like the 50 milligrams. If you think you can take the 100 milligrams, be my guest, you do not want to take too much of this because this is one of those things where you can take too much. So, and also it builds up in your body so the effects get stronger the longer you keep taking it. This suggests that you take one capsule three times daily on an empty stomach as needed or at bedtime as 5-HTP may produce drowsiness and it can. So what are, what are the things that 5-HTP help with? A lot of things. So like I said before, sleep, like it says in here, drowsiness. So sleep, restfulness, anxiety, mood, appetite, things like that. And that's crazy to think about, but yes, it can, because serotonin plays a huge part in your brain. Uh, it helps with, it's like the satisfaction chemical, you know? It makes you feel good, so to speak. This is the size of the capsule right here. It's not too big, a little tiny little thing. You can get it. 5-HTP, uh, L5-HTP that is. So like I said, it's like the last building block in the biosynthesis to serotonin. And uh, it has been shown in actually a lot of clinical trials to help with a lot of things like anxiety, mood, depression. It can be used to help target obesity because like I said, it does help with appetite, which is, I mean, too much of it can actually make your appetite go too low. Uh, so when I say help with appetite, it means it suppresses that you feel satisfied because of the serotonin that you don't want to keep eating to get that satisfaction, that full feeling. Why I picked it up, again, I think it's going to help with muscle. It's made from L-tryptophan. L-tryptophan is essential amino acid. It's good for building muscle. Uh, the L5-HTP is, like I said, a building block that gets converted to serotonin. Serotonin is great for rest. You need to rest to build muscle. You need to be resting a lot more. You need to have good restful sleep. And if you're dieting, if you're trying to lose weight, you're going into bodybuilding or something like that, you might need to suppress your appetite a little. If you're can help with moods. So if you're dieting harshly for a show and you're getting a little, you, just, you know, you're feeling a little crabby and cranky, maybe this will help you out. Maybe this will help your mood a little bit because it's gonna produce that serotonin, that happy chemical that's gonna make you feel better. So that's why I picked it up. Just a couple things. I thought maybe I'd try it out, see what it does. I know serotonin is a huge part of like depression, anxiety, or OCD, things like that. And OCD is actually a byproduct of anxiety I'm a little OCD, and I noticed when taking this, I'm a little less OCD, but I've also been working on that in a couple other things. So I'm not gonna attribute completely to this because I'm doing things like, um, it's called response therapy. So like you submit yourself to, for me, like I pick up my clothes. So you submit yourself to something like dirtying all your clothes and then you refuse to respond. You just sit there and look at it as it's dirty and you do not pick. A Little bit on me, but anyway, L5 HTP. So, like I said, it does build up. You might want to start with a 50 milligram dose. This is 100 milligram capsules. I only take one a day. I do not take three. Twice a day, maybe, if that. And I don't take valerian root with it. Um, I get some good sleep with it. You can have nightmares if you take too much. 
Um, another negative side effect is low libido even. So if you're watching my horny goat weed video and you're trying to increase your libido, you might want to stay away from this if you're trying to increase that because this can lower your sex drive. It can lower your libido. Um, it can lower your appetite too much to where it's not good. But if you do want to lower your appetite a little bit because you're trying to fight BC or weight loss, you're trying to diet well, this will help you out by creating that serotonin. We can go into serotonin in another video or you can look it up yourself. And L5-HTP actually works pretty similarly to a lot of the SSRI medications that they prescribe at doctor's offices and dispense at pharmacies such as citalopram, fluoxetine, peroxetine, sertraline, stuff like that that they already, pre like they already prescribe for OCD, anxiety, and depression, stuff like that. So these things help serotonin, your, like help produce the serotonin in your brain. So does this. So... But with those things, like with the SSRI uh, meds, you can get nightmares if you take a whole bunch of them or you can, you know, get low libido. And it's the same thing with this L5-HTP. So it does increase sleep. It does decrease appetite. There are actually a lot of clinical studies on this. I'm not going to go into them. I get a lot of my information from WebMD, just in case you're wondering, and a lot of sources across the internet. But I'm not going to list them here. Like I said in this video, I contribute my stuff to WebMD um, for the most part. Uh, but and some 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 very little Wikipedia but if you're looking for that kind of stuff if you really want to see for yourself just type it in Google you will find it I mean the internet is vast it's crazy but there have been clinical trials that show that this actually works uh, there have been a lot of tests on this I mean it is a component in your brain it is it's a by you know it's something that you know you make so and it's important it's actually part of the process to make serotonin the biosynthesis of it. So there you go, there you have it, L5-HTP, little overview. People have been using this for a good while. I mean, we've been using it in our entire lives because it's made in the brain, you can just add a little more. So there you have it guys, L5-HTP, the amino acid. Quick overview, hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, if you did, leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me what, and give me a supplement to cover next. Tell me what you think about the video or let me know if you've tried this before and how it's worked for you. If you did like this video and you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that button down below and the bell so you know when the next one drops. Sorry it's been kind of few and far in between, guys. I'm really busy. Hope you enjoyed this video. As always, take it easy. Stay natty, Team Natty out.